It was the largest gathering of anti-coronavirus protesters in Europe. German authorities say some 38,000 people flooded the streets of Berlin on Saturday, decrying current coronavirus measures as being an affront to democracy and greatly exaggerated. We hold Corona for a ungefähr normale, schwere Grippe and not more. And that's what we want to talk about. Zu demonstrieren ist ganz einfach, weil es um die Freiheit geht. Und das ist ein Hochfest der Demokratie, wenn sich Menschen aus unterschiedlichen Richtungen für die Freiheit einsetzen. Anti-Mask-Banners dominated the protests, while far-right supporters displayed nationalist slogans and neo-Nazi insignia. Others wore T-shirts promoting conspiracy theories. Refusing to observe social distancing rules, police ordered the protesters to disband halfway through the march. Far-right supporters were also intercepted as they tried to storm the German parliament. Elsewhere in Europe, crowds gathered in London's Trafalgar Square, calling the coronavirus a hoax and demanding an end to restrictions. Meanwhile, in Paris, where the wearing of face masks is mandatory, a few hundred people also rallied on Saturday to oppose the new rules. I think it's not effective. D'abord parce qu'on les manipule trop, d'abord parce qu'on ne les change pas assez. The gathering was also cut short after French police dispersed the crowd. 123 fines were issued to protesters not wearing masks.